The theme for today's prayer service is Children, you make our world a better place to live in. A beautiful morning and a warm welcome to each one of you present here. Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru, our first Prime Minister, was well known for his passion for children. So, on his birthday, 14th November, we celebrate Children's Day. Let us take a prayerful posture and begin with today's prayer service. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, each child is a gift, an amazing blessing from God. A child, in all its simplicity, has a lot to teach to the world. They are beam of sunlight from which the world gets inspired to seek a better tomorrow. Saint Teresa rightly said, the child is the beauty of God present in the world. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Matthew, chapter 19, verses 13 to 15. Jesus blesses little children. Some people brought children to Jesus for him to place his hands on them and pray for them. But the children, but the disciples scolded the children. Jesus said, Let the little children come to me and do not stop them, because the kingdom of heaven belongs to them. He placed his hands on them and then went away. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Christ loves little children. That is why he said to his, the disciples, to let the children come to him and not to stop them. For the kingdom of heaven belongs to such as these. Children are meek, modest, humble, without pride, and not desirous of grandeur and superiority. How precious are the trusting hearts of little children. We can learn much from the, the innocent example to devote total trust in God. Children are a blessing and a gift from God. Their spirits are filled with innocence, joy, and laughter. Jesus tells us to be like children and to come to him full of faith and trust. Children have beautiful qualities in them which are to be admired and imbibed by the rest of the world. Let us put forth these qualities before the Lord and ask him to bless mankind with the qualities of a child. After each prayer, let your response be, Lord, Bless the world with the qualities of a child. Love. Each child is an image of God's love for his creation. May humanity learn from the child unselfish and boundless love for each other to make this world a better place to live in. 
for his victory lord bless the world with the qualities of a child optimism children are very optimistic and that is inspiring and motivating especially in the moments when we feel helpless no matter how hard life gets due to the pandemic help us oh lord to keep looking forward for something positive for this we pray lord bless the world with the qualities of a child innocence the charm of a child's innocence is irreplaceable that is what makes the world a better place a place where one can enjoy purity and feel loved and love without ulterior motives for this we pray lord bless the world with the qualities of a child truthfulness a child always speaks the truth without thinking of the consequences heavenly father as the world is guilty of children and child exploitation child abuse and child atrocities who oh, the immense quality of the truthfulness of the child on the world so that all the children and everyone on the earth will find a better place to live in our response lord bless the world with the qualities of a child sensitivity a child has the quality of sensitivity he is sensitive to the needs of others on this day let us pray that we may stop being indifferent and be sensitive to the needs of others for this we pray to the lord our response lord bless the world with the qualities, the qualities of, of a child, child. concluding prayer lord jesus as we celebrate children's day we thank you for the gift of each and every child without whom the world would be incomplete continue to place your loving hand on your children and on us to make this world a beautiful place to live in
Why we keep growing, serving Jehovah, and finding joy in the part we're playing. We must remember.